So in this video, we will talk about Android 14, Fun Touch OS 14 update for Vivo V25. Now, if you have Vivo V25, then you will definitely get Android 14, Fun Touch OS 14 update from Vivo. Now, Vivo V25 has a powerful MediaTek Dimensity 900 chipset, which is capable of running Android 14 without any issues. Now, Android 14 will be second Android update for Vivo V25, and this could be the last Android update for Vivo V25 as it is only eligible to get two major android updates but for now you will get android 14 fun touch os 14 update on your vivo v25 now talking about the features so google added a lot of new features to android 14 and they will keep adding more features and changes to android 14 till the official release but for now let's take a look at some main features that android 14 brings so there is a predictive back arrow gesture by which you can preview the previous section before going back so basically you will be able to see which page will show up before completely going back you get flash notifications so whenever you get a notification the flash of your smartphone will flicker you can also use a screen flash notification to get notified with the color you choose to flicker on your screen there is a dedicated nearby share option in share menu the navigation bar now vivo will modify the stock android 14 features into their own interface of untouch and apart from Android 14 features, we will also see some unique features in FunTouch OS 14 that will be completely based on Vivo OS 14 will be revealed. So as for the Android 14 of Android 14 update for your Vivo smartphone, and once Vivo start giving Android 14 update, you will get the update within few weeks. Now, I can't give you guys the exact release date of the update at the time of this video, but you can expect to get Android 14 update by the end of 2023. So all you can do right now is wait till the you know, so make sure that you are subscribed to this channel and yeah, that's pretty much it from my side. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you all in the next one. Peace out. EA Sports. It's in the game. Game time begins, taking tackle the challenge, crash, course, collision, head to head battle with 11 opposing components, battered up adrenaline rush, ready to get it. on the line and swimming, you make the call, this is the game of football, EA Sports, it's in the game, doing it, play by play, moving forward with the aim, first play, you may choose your star, running back, second in yards, you try to same and get sacked, oh, third down, what to do now, it seems your only interest away from a touchdown, no matter is on you this is john madden 2002 no matter what happens the choice is on you this is john madden 2002 The world of John Madden 2002. Y'all players need to switch up your offensive patterns before they break from the huddle. I read their thoughts. Farrell March, Hail Mary, EA Sports. The defense impregnable, plays all legible. The tolerance to withstand pain is unmeasurable. Heat, rain, snow, sleep, hell. You leave it all on the Welcome to training mode. If you don't know what a halfback off tackle is, then this is a mode for you. If you have trouble identifying who the primary receiver is in a pass play, then training mode is for you. So sit back, relax, and have fun. School is now in session. Open your textbooks to page one. The split-backs formation is mainly a passing formation. 
typically featuring two wide receivers, a tight end, and two running backs. When running the split backs curls play, you're hoping to find holes in the defensive coverage, usually a zone. The two wide receivers run deep curls, trying to find seams in those zones. The tight end runs a shorter curl over the middle. The fullback here stays in for pass protection. You hit your receiver as he's curling into the seam to make this play a success. Set! Hut! Hut! I hope you paid attention, because now you're up. Set! Hut! Not bad. Nice play, good catch. You're getting the hang of this passing thing. Break! Set! Good job on that play. You waited just enough to allow the receiver to run his route and then make the grab. Break! The I formation is a well balanced offensive play system with one wide receiver and two tight ends. But both running backs are lined up in a straight line behind the quarterback usually for the running game. To make the halfback screen work, the left guard and center need to do a bit of acting. The left guard and center pass block before releasing out to the flat. If they release too soon, the defense will know that the screen is coming. After they release, the halfback moves into position behind his blockers. The quarterback dumps a pass off to the back, who uses the blockers to pick up big yardage downfield. Set! 